Welcome back, everybody. I'm so excited about this. A new group of young bakers entered the kitchen for a chance to win the Kids Baking Championship, but only one will take the cake. Yeah, see what we did there. We can only hope that that one is my new best friend. I love this guy. 13-year-old St. Louisan Tarek Husseini on the show, ladies and gentlemen. He joins us now on Great Day St. Louis. Thank you so much for being Thank here. Thank you for having me. So here's my understanding of the show. Correct me if I'm wrong. There's only three competitors left. Yes. Started with nine kids, only three left, and oh. you are one of the three. I am one of the three in the finale. Do you already know who wins this? I do know who wins this, but that is top secret. I knew you were gonna say that. I knew you were gonna say that. You're making the people at the, uh, the Food Network happy. How long have you been baking, and what got you interested in it in the first place? So I've been baking since I was six years old, and I would help my mom make cupcakes in the kitchen. Mm -hmm. And then when I moved overseas, I started baking myself with cake mixes and stuff. But then when I moved to St. Louis, um, I really got in depth making everything from scratch, um, looking up tons of YouTube tutorials, cool. and then I just l learned along the way. I heard your other passion, you tell me if this is true, is Legos. That is true. Is it true that you built a Lego replica of the set that the show is filmed on? I did build a Lego <laughs> replica of the set. That is the cool, that, that was like instant ticket onto the show, in my opinion. If I'm a producer, I'm like, dude, the guy built a Lego replica of our set. All right, so tell me about the cupcakes that you made for us. Okay, so I made a triple berry cupcake, mm -hmm. and I'm gonna frost it with a vanilla bean Swiss meringue buttercream. Excellent, and you talked about how you like to start with the cake mix, but kind of ad lib, a little little bit and add your oh. own flair and that's no cake mixes here. no 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 so this so this tell this is strawberry but other berries mixed in as well so yeah? no um, so I, f <laughs> I used my recipe that I used my base recipe for a berry cake a berry cake. and okay. then I replaced the strawberry with tri mi like triple berry oh, so okay. there's blackberries blueberries and raspberries gotcha in. Now this decoration that you do is phenomenal. Can you show us how you're able to do that? Sure. So because I would never in a million years be able to do it that, that <laughs> beautifully. So I made roses. Mm -hmm. they're, they're roses. They're very pretty. So I take my piping bag mm -hmm. with a Wilton 2D tip. That. What, a what 2D tip? A Wilton 2D oh, tip. Sure. That's what it's called. So it's for, if you're taking notes at home, the old Wilton 2D. We all know that. Yeah, yep. everyone definitely. Yep, yep. So then you pipe in the middle. And then you just swirl it out. You make that look so easy. And then you've got a different, is this the same same ingredients but just different color? This is the same buttercream, different color. Okay. It is a Wilton 104 Korea tip. The 104 Korea. I just Wilton learned fans. that. Did you really? Just learned Me that too. off of this. Me too. That was a coincidence. And that's how you just do a little kind of leaf around the side? Yeah, then you just take the tip and you just yeah. press and drag out and make some leaves. My, see, you can tell this kid's been on live television before because his hand doesn't even shake. I would be all over the place. Well, listen, here's what I want to tell everybody at home. It's this coming Monday. That's the big yes. Kids Baking Championship finale on the Food Network. All of St. Louis okay. is going to be pulling for you. I and hope. when you're one of these big, super popular mega chefs with his own TV network, don't forget us here at Great Day St. Louis. I will okay? not forget this. Thank you, Tarek, <laughs> very much. These are beautiful. How about that, Laura Hadiger? St. Louis' own Tarek Hussein. What a cool kid. Soon to be champion. Oh, that was awesome. And all the Lego stuff you're doing. And I can't believe he knows, and he walks around not able to tell anybody yeah. if he's won or not. That's that would crazy. That be so hard. Oh, well, good stuff. That guy is going to do big things mm -hmm. in the future, too. Thank you.